Good. I'm with CigarNews.com. I'm here at Hope Ashton Distributors in Philadelphia, PA. I'm here covering the Perdomo event, and I'm here with Nick Perdomo, Anthony Mazzola from uh, Perdomo Cigars. Check it out, guys. Yeah, yeah. Hello. All right. Just tell your name and Nick Perdomo. This is one of my one of my best friends. Lenny Holtz. Lenny Nick Perdomo. So on the thing you buy free, get one free. On the box deals, you have a choice of free gifts. You get the box discount, and you can go to the lighter. Travel case with a five pack. Or the uh, little Sigma Clutter and a five pack. Hope to see you down there. That's Anthony Mazzola from Holt. And now we're going to go check out Nick for a second. Right. So Perdomo products. <laughs> and actually Perdomo has their own section. Wow, that is tremendous. <laughs> Nick, say something, Nick, something for the guys out there on Twitter. This is, Nick, this is Irving from CigarNews.com. I'm here with Nick Perdomo of Perdomo Cigars. Nice, how you doing? We're having a big Perdomo event here at home. I want to thank you all for your support of uh, Perdomo Cigars. You guys all have a great day. I went out of my way. So, uh, Anthony, tell me, uh, what do you think about the uh, industries in, as in terms of the uh, tobacco industry? Well, first of all, I love my job. You know, I want to thank uh, Eric for being here from uh, Tomorrowdoms.com. Thank Nick Perdomo for being here tonight. Did he say nice luck? Um, you know, the cigar industry is a great industry. Uh, I'm very passionate about it. Uh, I'm very excited for Irv and Tomorrowdoms.com. Uh, you know, they have a lot of promise in the industry. I'm looking to cover our industry uh, extensively, which for me personally, it makes me very happy with anyone who wants to cover our industry and, uh, and follow us. And, uh, and, they, and you know, we feel that what we do in our industry is uh, it's very newsworthy for our followers in our industry. So we appreciate her being here from SubartNews.com. I'm very excited to, uh, to follow her and uh, the guys from SubartNews.com and what they have to bring to our industry to make it a better place for people to go, uh, find out what's going on in the cigar world, uh, what's coming out, what's new, what the new trends are in our industry. It's always a pleasure to, to meet people like her and meet the guys from cigarnews.com because they keep you abreast of all the situations that are happening in our industry. And uh, people that are willing to do that, uh, you know, that, that, that says a lot for our industry. So uh, uh, I want to thank them all for being here. I want to thank Nick Perdomo for being here, Eric for being here. 
Hardroof.com for being here. Salute to all of you. I appreciate you guys being here. And uh, here comes uh, you know, some happy times for you guys today. I wish you all the the best in the future. Give up to all of you. So uh, tell me, what are we expecting at uh, IPCPR? Well, we got a couple of new things. We've got two new line extensions on the champagne. We'll have a new Corona Extra, which is going to be in five and five weeks, like 46. We'll have that champagne noir. Also, we're going to have a new brand, Quick 2006. It's going to be three shades, which will be a five by six and a six by six and a seven by six. You know, and the reason we're doing this is a lot of our customers. The access will take the cigars to this year's 2006 crop of Grand Cru. It's fantastic. And then back to commemorate our 20th anniversary, we'll have a new Fernando 20th anniversary coming out. 66 ring gauge cigar, bloody box press. The first is Fernando, each cigar is going to be on the cell phone. And they're phenomenal to celebrate our 20th anniversary. So we got a lot of things going on. Um, now, what I was going to say was, um, what brought you to the uh, cigar industry? I know your, your dad was in the industry. Did you go with uh, say, for instance, his advice of taking over the company, or it was just a passion of yours as you were a kid? I'll, I'll be honest with you, it's always been a passion of mine. It's since my father, my grandfather, my grandfather's brother, my uncle were all in the cigar industry in Cuba. It was something I, I kind of grew up with. And I decided in the later part of 1991 that I would try to start my own business. My father always said, if you work hard, you can attain anything you want in this country. Thank God, after 20 years, for now, most of the staples, most humidors around the world. And, We'd like to thank everybody for that. Not only our, our retail but our culture. So, what do you think of uh, cigarnews.com and what we're aiming to uh, accomplish? I think it's great. I think anytime we can, we can bring news about such a wonderful industry like cigars and the pride and passion and love of everyone, of everyone who's passing cigars, I think it's a fantastic thing. And I congratulate you. Thank you so much for your time, and you know, hopefully, we'll have a better. Uh, Interview at uh, IPCPR. Sounds good. I'm looking forward to it. I'd like to thank everybody out there for the support for us.